Hello everyone, I am FMZ and welcome to episode 29 of Glory Glory Tottenham Hotspur. Today we are off to Wembley to take on Chelsea in the Carabao Cup final. Let's get to it. Run the intro. Just a quick recap from the previous episode. If you've missed it, go back and watch it. The link is up the top for the 4-1 demolition of Barcelona. Luis Suarez getting sent off to boot as we put one foot in the quarterfinals of the Champions League. Now, there's been no league games played since we were last together, although teams have played around us. So Manchester United and Liverpool have closed the gap slightly to four and five respectively. Chelsea and Manchester City have yet to play. Obviously, Chelsea are involved in the match. We are involved in today. That is the League Cup final. Let's head to Wembley and look at the match preview. So here is the match preview for the Carabao Cup final. We are 6-4 to four to win the match. Chelsea are 13-8. to eight. Our form is excellent with four wins from five. Chelsea have won three in five. We have the better of the previous meetings between the two sides at 2-1. But we do have some problems. So no Hugo Lloris. He is doubtful. He will not play. Jack Butland will start in goal in the Carabao Cup final. Eric Lamella, Lucas Moura and Harry Winks are the three that are missing for us. For Chelsea, Mitsu Bashwai, Cesar Astelaqueta and Gedson Fernandez are three doubtful players. So they may take part, they may not. So here are the two starting lineups for the League Cup final, starting with ourselves. So we start with Butland in goal, Manera, Alderweird, Sanchez, Rose, Barella, Eriksson, Pulisic, Ali. Sancho starts the final with Harry Kane up front and captaining the side. Chelsea start with Kepper in goal, Zuma, Jimenez, Rudiger, Emerson, Kante, De Jong, Jorginho, Willian. Baguin with Maratta up front. So losing Hugo Lloris at the 11th hour is not ideal preparation, although Jack Butland, other than the semi-final, played every other game in the League Cup. So would he have played, would he have not have played? Probably not, is my firm answer to that. But he is playing. He's going to have to. Let's hope it doesn't come down to him as we are off and underway. Rudiger. Pulisic with the tackle and he's away. Keep running, Christian. Keep running. He's still going. Still going. Saved by Kepa. Baguin with the free kick. Plays it to Willian. Go out to him. Done him shoot. Blocked. Blocked again. And that's your lot for the first half. Not exciting whatsoever. An opportunity for us and an opportunity for them. So it's going to have to get better in the second half. Otherwise, we are going the distance. Second half on the way. It's Baguin with the corner. Maratta's open. Butler with the save. Baguin with the corner again. Sends it in. Willian gets up. Hits the bar. And it's cleared by Barella. Chelsea are on the offensive off the start of the second half. So we're going to make a change very quickly. 
It's not been Jaden Sancho's day, unfortunately. So we're going to bring on Anthony Martial. Don't let it run out. He hasn't. Pulisic has picked it up. Might be a mistake by Emerson because he's out of position. And we are coming forward with Pulisic. Sends it into the box. Jimenez cleared it away. Ericsson with the corner. Sends it in. Zuma heads it out. Deli Ali picks it up. Out of wield! Oh, Toby, you lovely man. You lovely, lovely man. That's his fifth goal of the season, and it may be his most important. Ericsson with the corner in. Pinball in the box. Deli Ali with a good touch. Slammed into the net by Toby Adewerald. 1 0 to Tottenham Hotspur. Chelsea will come again, no doubt. Emerson and Pulisic in a foot race. Kepa's under pressure. He's under real pressure. And Pulisic has put it in the net. That's a nightmare for Kepa. Delighted. No sympathy for him. Unfortunately, on the big stage, you either do it or you don't. Emerson with a roll back. In fairness, he was closed down by both Harry Kane and Christian Pulisic. Pulisic profits 2-0 to Tottenham. One hand on the trophy. Zuma heads it forward. Martial. Ericsson. I thought he was going to ping it. Kane. He does ping it wide to Danny Rose. Rose is coming forward. On to Harry Kane. Can he finish it? Puts it wide. It's a corner. It's a good tackle by Beguin. Incidentally, Ericsson with the corner. Sends it in. Oh, Kep has somehow managed to keep hold of that. I'm not sure how. Let's have a look at a second change, shall we? A few tired bodies out there, so I'm going to bring on Eric Dyer. We're going to take off Christian Eriksen, and we're going to send Barella into his more natural box-to-box -box role. Olivier Giroud is on for Chelsea, so they're going to be changing tactic, I would imagine, with 20 to play. And Danny Drinkwater is in as well. Kurt Zuma going off, so they're changing the formation as well. Right, into the last 10 we go. It's going to be Deli Alley to come off. It's going to be Wow Felix to go on. Butland with the free kick. I'm going to say it quietly. He's had very little to do so far, Jack Butland. Toby plays it back. Oh, my God. Butland's headed it away. Why did I open my mouth? Giroud saved by Butland again. Willian is on the rebound. Manera heads it away. And we clear the danger. Into four additional minutes. Chelsea, if they're going to have a comeback, they better quickly do it. Otherwise, the cup is coming home. Eric Dyer looking over the top, looking for Pulisic, who's picked it up at the second attempt, plays it across to Anthony Martial. Can he square it? Yes, he can. It's cleared away. Just eating up the seconds now. That's good. Giroud, not a Chelsea player within any sight of him. Willian tries to find Giroud again. He's in behind. Can he pull one back? Good block. Kante puts it wide. And that is Chelsea's race run. Jack Butland will take the goal kick. And that is it. We are five-time winners of the League Cup. <sighs> it may be pissing down with rain, but it's lovely. It's always nice to win the League Cup. And Jack Butland has not conceded a goal in 375 minutes of playing for Tottenham. Thought it was a gamble, him having to come into the team, as it proved... The other keeper, Kepa, was the gamble. And that's lovely. It's always nice to beat Chelsea in a final. 2-0, fairly comfortable. Jack Butland, not a lot to do other than his little moment. But Kepa up the other end, what was he doing? Never mind. If you've enjoyed today's video, please leave a like. If you haven't subscribed to the channel and would like to do so, please hit the subscribe button down in the corner. That was episode 29 of Glory, Glory, Tottenham Hotspur. It is a win under the arch at Wembley in the League Cup final. And there is nothing better. I'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.